So this is Nancy, and welcome back to Nan's Next Nuts. I got my very first Happy Meal. I am so excited. So I wanted to get on here and show you guys what I got. Now, I've been following a YouTube channel called Cabin Fever Crochet. And it is done by Helene, and she's up in North Washington. I've been watching her for quite a while, and we got to chatting back and forth. She has been my biggest supporter. Not kidding. I mean, just has been there for me all the way. Every step of the way as I was taking steps to get ready to start my channel. And she was there. I'd tell her about the yarn that I got uh, in my celebration to start my channel. And I had, in my introduction video... I showed some yarn that I purchased and said that it was a gift, and it was a gift for her, uh, for all her help. And I got her um, some really unique yarn that I thought that she would just love to try. So anyway, um, here's the card that she sent me. Really cute. And I just have to tell you, she has the most beautiful handwriting, the most beautiful cursive. Very talented lady. Very talented. And so there's squishiness in my mail. She got me this Yarn Bee Fresh Heaven in the colorway Light Blue. And she got me two of them. They're 180 yards a piece. And I, in my first squishiness feeling, I thought that it was cotton. And so I went and I looked it up looked at it to see, you know, what cotton blend that it, it was. It's not cotton at all. It's tinsel. And it was like, okay, that's not what I thought tinsel was. So I had to look it up, and it's a, it's made from wood. And so I'm surprised I learned that. I thought tinsel was kind of like the sparkly. This is a lion brand shawl and a cake and the sparkly fibers in there is what I thought tinsel was. You know, tinsel like old fashioned Christmas tree had tinsel on it. Now they make it out of plastic, but that's in my mind what I thought tinsel was. So I really learned from uh, looking that up. And so she also has a eBay and an Etsy shop called Wild Rose Acres. I don't really think that you can read this. So I'm not going to... Hopefully it's not as blurry as it looks from here. <laughs> anyway, so you might want to go check that out. She has some really beautiful jewelry there. Uh, and speaking of that, she made me some really beautiful stitch markers. And there's a butterfly with a nice glass bead and an owl and a peace sign. And the fasteners on here are really nice too. It's not something that's going to snag on my arm and that is just really great. Thank you so much, Helene, because I know that you had made these. Thank you. And the biggest surprise was she sent me this yarnology hook. Now, we'd talked hooks before, and she knows that I'm a, a boy user. Um, haven't really tried anything else. I just used that, and I'm perfectly happy with it. Anything else, I kind of thought uh, I would get it and not really like it, but this is kind of nice because now I can try this. And, I, you know, I tried Susan Bates, but, you know, either you're a Susan Bates or you're a boy. So it seems like. So this is really exciting to uh, be able to try something new. Hey, give it a shot. Anyway, so go ahead over and check out the uh, Cabin Fever crochet on YouTube and check out her eBay and her Etsy shop. 
Uh, I think you'll find some, you'll be surprised. There's some really nice stuff there. Some jewelry and handmade items. So I just wanted to pop on and show you and share with you what I got in my Happy Mail. Thank you. Have a lovely evening.